Hi, today I'm reviewing the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Lip Booster. Comes in two colors, one which is clear, so not really a color, and then the other one has a slight rosy taupe finish to it, if you can see that and it sells for $23 and I will say the first thing I absolutely loved the very first time I used it is the brush that it comes with it's not your typical doe foot applicator it just is definitely made well to hug your lips and this is almost like a serum for your lips it's meant to uh, have hyaluronic acid which kind of plumps out and diminishes any fine lines that you have around your lips and also moisturize them and you can kind of see it doesn't have much of a color but the this is the rose finish but it's just got a little hint there but I just even just using it on my hand I love this applicator so I wish more companies could almost copy this and use this um, in the serum at first when you apply it to your lips it feels nice and your lips feel plump and smooth and um, you can definitely apply this under lipstick after you apply this if there's any excess I would just gently wipe it off and then apply your lipstick on top of it um, unfortunately I noticed the next day after using this my lips felt a little dry and almost peeling so I'm not sure there's some perfume or some fragrance in here so I'm not sure if that's what irritated my lips um, or if it was the lipstick I was using but it's a lipstick I'd used before, so I tend to think it was this, because this is the new thing I started using on my lips recently. So it does have a lot of nice oils in it. It's got argan oil and loofah oil, um, and of course the hyaluronic acid in there. But once you introduce any perfume or fragrance into things, um, people with sensitive skin, it, everything kind of can be thrown out of balance there once you introduce that. So. For those reasons, unfortunately, although I, I love the feeling of this product at first, um, and I love the applicator, but unfortunately for those reasons, I'm going to give it uh, one thumb down. So, if you guys had a chance to try this, or are you uh, devoted to a specific lip balm, let me know what it is. I'm kind of interested in seeing what you guys use on your lips, or if you just go with the general chapstick, that's what I used to use when I was little. So. Um, but some people are very loyal to that. So leave me a comment and let me know what it is. And also feel free to subscribe. I come out with at least one new review every day. Thank you guys.